hey there beautiful people welcome back to my kitchen thank you so much for tuning in so i'm gonna jump right into it today we're making something called a budget pasta which is very beginner friendly and also easy and quick to make so stay tuned as i show you step by step on how to make this pasta so here are a few things that we'll be using today i have two grated tomatoes some pepper juice some pasta some milk some flour pill chards um, we have half a block of grated cheese and half an onion that is diced and for flavor we'll be using smoked chili flakes, paprika and barbecue spice. So I'm just going to wash my hands before I get started with the cooking. So we're starting off with our pasta. I'm adding boiled water to my pot. I'm gonna add two teaspoons of oil to the water as well. The reason we're adding oil to the water is so that the pasta does not stick together. Once my water starts boiling, I add some pasta. I am using penne pasta, but you're not restricted to using this specific pasta. You can use any type of pasta. And I'm gonna leave it there to boil for seven to eight minutes because I don't want it to overcook. So in the saucepan, I am going to melt half a tablespoon of margarine. You can use butter. I'm also adding two tablespoons of flour. And then I'm going to mix the margarine and flour together using a fork and then I'm going to add a bit of milk. So I don't really measure how much milk to use, however, I determine how much milk is enough by looking at the thickness and creaminess of the sauce. So I mix my ingredients together using a whisk to make sure that the sauce is smooth and creamy. Make sure that your sauce is not too thick. If it is too thick, add a bit more of milk. Once the sauce is smooth, I'm adding a bit of cheese, maybe a handful, and I'm going to whisk that in. I'm only using some of the cheese because I'm going to use the rest for later. So now I'm going to heat up my pan with some olive oil and add my diced onions. Now I'm adding some mild pepper juice. I decided that I want to chop them into thinner slices.
am now adding my grated tomatoes however you can also use canned tomatoes i also feel like canned tomatoes would work out way better than this Next step is to clean my pearl chards and by cleaning I mean deboning them. I open them in half and remove the bones inside. I strained my pasta off off camera and remember I only cooked it for seven to eight minutes on medium to high heat uh, because we don't want it to overcook now I'm mixing everything together and I'm going to add it to an oven dish and then once I've done that I'm going to add the cheese sauce on top I actually realized that I should have made the cheese sauce last because it has now hardened however I was able to fix that I just added a tiny bit of milk and heated it up on the stove so I'm just gonna spread the sauce over the pasta add some cheese and parsley then I'm going to pop it into the oven on 200 degrees and let it bake for about five to eight minutes. 